Hi, Lou Caruso from Surfcasters Journal. Today, as you can see, we finally got smart and we came here in the summer instead of coming down here in the middle of February, beginning of March, when we got a 60 mile an hour wind and it's freezing. So today we got some nice conditions, gentle breeze from the west, and I thought I'd show you uh, a nice rod by Rod Geeks. Um, they came out with a nice eight foot rod Faster action, rated three quarters to three ounces, and I thought I'd build one up here for, for, for some uh, fluke fishing. Um, with the recent declines in bass the way they are, a lot of guys have turned to the, spending their summers on the beach and actually fluke fishing, and it's turned out very well. I've caught, and so I've caught some really nice fish um, right off the beach, go out with my wife, we spend the day on the beach, fished some of the troughs, and done some very good fluke fishing. Had fish over five pounds now, and it's worked out very well. So I thought I'd show you the uh, rod and uh, give you the opportunity to see it in action. Um, it's rated three quarters to four, and it easily throws a half ounce. And the great part about it is the blank only weighs three and three quarter ounces. So in this case, I took it, I built it with titanium single foot guides. So the entire rod weighs under six ounces. And it's a pleasure, I can walk the beach. Usually I'm in my shorts, I can go in the water, stay cool, and it's a pleasure. You don't have your 11 foot rod, you're not jerking around, trying to lug this around. Catching five pound fish with an 11M and just horsing them in, this, you can have a good time with it. Right here I have a half ounce bucktail with a little trailer on it. Um, this has worked very well for me this year. Um, and it's, it's not a pork rind or anything, it's just a rubber tail, white pearl, on a white bucktail. It's worked out well. Now, as you can see, it'll take a nice light bucktail and throws it very well, throws it pretty far. All right, being a faster action, it's easy to work this bucktail. I actually just got hit twice. Can't catch fish when you actually go out fishing. But you turn around here to make a video and you start getting slammed. Doing this wrong, I guess. I paired this rod up with a nice light BS100. Not the lightest rod, reel in the world, but it does the job. I have a habit of laying my reels down on the sand all the time. And I didn't want an issue down the road of being jammed up with sand. I mean, that, you can use any reel in uh, 3500. 4,000, even the 5,000 class reels will work fine with this. Um, I just went with the VS100, it's what I had, um, so I put it on here. It balances very nice. And again, being such a nice light blank, this entire outfit, you can sit here working it all day long and it won't fatigue you whatsoever, whatsoever. Yeah, we're going to give this a shot with a uh, Super Strike 2 and 3 eighths daughter. See how she casts. See how it works the plug. Normally, I wouldn't pair this rod to throw daughters, but you never know. Be out fluke fishing and you get a bluefish blitz um, where you want to throw something on in a hurry, or some of the spots I fish are very tight, you have sod banks behind you. It's nice to sneak back there and uh, clip on a plug that you know you won't have a problem getting clearance in the back. It works. Always keep a daughter, always keep a papa in my bag no matter what I'm using. Because you just never know.
So as you can see, the rod casts just started fine. Um, as a matter of fact, it actually works the starter a little bit better than an uh, 11 foot rod, maybe because of the short, shortness of the rod, I'm not sure, but it gives it a, a nice side to side sweeping action, um, which I don't always see on an 11 foot stick. Not sure why, but works. Hopefully one of these days we'll come down here, we'll be pleasantly surprised, we'll actually catch a fish here. Um, but yeah, this, this rod really, really does a good job. Um, like I said, I've been fishing it all this summer. I'm loving it with the bucktails. I also make a little flute rig. I use a round uh, sinker on a swivel so it can roll with the current and put a, a, a high-low type setup, sinker on the bottom, and uh, my bait up about eight inches off the bottom, and it's been very effective this year. So might be something you want to take a look at, reasonably priced, blank list for 90 bucks. You can get them in all kinds of colors for $15 more. And shipping again, $18.95, no matter how many you order, whether you order one or 10. It's nice deal.